What's going on, everybody? This is Al from PlaybugGamer.com. And in the last Dynasty video, we took on Boise State. And as you can tell by the score, we had no real issues there. The first half, offensively, we could do no wrong. And the second half was a, just a bit of a wash. We had our second string in there most of the time. And we ended up winning by 21. As you can tell, Boise State's just having a terrible season for whatever reason. But today we're taking on Louisiana Tech. We're three and one. They're two and two. We have a little more talent than they do. Offensively, they look pretty strong. They got a really good passing attack. We'll see how well they do against us today. Uh, but their defense is a very good. They, as you can tell, they like to throw the ball and they run a three, four defense. So I'll be able to maybe run a little bit more dive today. Of course, I run mostly dive anyways, but I may run the ball a little bit more if I keep seeing those three-man fronts. So we'll see how that goes. Okay, let's go to in-season recruiting. We're on a bit of a winning streak, so a lot of that should help on the recruiting front. And it looks like we are pretty stable with everybody. We're at the top of the list for this corner. We got a positive pitch, so we got a good chance of getting him. Same with this halfback, good shape there. We're kind of just holding steady for this guard. We just don't know a whole lot about him. Same with this guard. And then we got another halfback, Sean McCargo. We found a positive pitch. That is great. That means we'll probably end up getting both of those halfbacks. So as long as we can try to get one, that'd be great. We're at the top of the list for this corner. We're in good shape for this center, even though we don't know hardly anything about what he likes. Defensive tackle, last but not least. We're holding steady. We're in the top three. So we're in good shape for how many do we have? About nine guys. I think we'll end up with maybe six, possibly. And if that's the case, then we're not going to do a whole lot of off-season recruiting at all. We're going to get most of these guys from the regular season, which means we could put a ton of points into training in the off-season. All right, let's go to Sports Illustrated. I don't really... We can check the Heisman watch. I was curious to see who is on there. Nothing that affects us. We go to top 25 polls. Just looking here. I don't know if we're even close. We'll find out once we get to the next game. We can go to conference standings. And check out our team info screen. Now, Washington, that he's out for quite a while. Bryant, he's our backup strong safety. Out for a few more weeks. And you look at our offensive leaders, Gronk is starting to play some really good football. These last two games, he's really picked things up. Had a terrible game against Idaho, but has really turned on since then. Scruggs, our running game is about non-existent, but it's there when we need it to pick up a few yards here and there. But we all know our passing game is our strength. Wide receiving, you know, Ferguson is having a great season. I don't know how many touchdowns he's got, but he's got a very good yard average. But look at the defensive side. Look who is leading in tackles and sacks and interceptions. That's our impact linebacker, Kalilamoku, is having just an All-American type season. He may end up getting some awards by the time it's all said and done. Now, I don't know in terms of how good that is compared to other linebackers, but it's just really cool seeing one guy leading in all three categories. I don't know if I've ever seen that before on my own team. That's extremely rare, but pretty cool to say the least. Let's check out Louisiana Tech. This is a, a, a conference game. They just got beat by New Mexico State. They're injury free. Looks like they got a quarterback's doing pretty well, as we saw from our stats from earlier. Rushing and receiving is this Franklin kid. So it looks like their halfback is doing everything for them, which is, again, that's really rare to see. You look at the defensive side, it looks like they got one guy who's doing leading both in tackles and sacks. I'm guessing he's an impact player of some sort. All right. I think that is all I need to see. We can go ahead and take on the Bulldogs. We can speed this up a little. So far, we've done a good job of not having anybody in trouble this year. I think all that over-discipline goes a long way. Let's go with the alternate away uniform. Let's add a little bit more green to our away uniform. Every now and then I like to mix it up with the uniforms. We are 37th in the country. I think if we just keep on winning, we'll eventually get back in there. 
I know we got one more rank game left. That's towards the end of the season. I already forgot. I think it's Georgia Tech. I'm assuming they're playing okay. Looks like we got some rain in the forecast. It's been a while since we've had any weather in our games. Not a big crowd. No wind, which should help both teams in the passing game. Us, Nevada, and Utah State are undefeated so far in the conference. Good looking uniforms. Red and blue, just it just goes well together. Who are they going to highlight? Looks like they're going to highlight Gronk. Fourth in the country in touchdowns. I didn't see the yardage. I went. I just focused on that one number. Hawaii. Okay. Go to the coin toss. We won it. I want the ball to start the second half. Now, in the last game, we had some real troubles on kickoff returns. I think uh, we gave up two. We ended up having one ourselves. We can check out their depth chart first. So Gronk is back at an impact quarterback. I want to see. I'm guessing we took it off the kicker. I hope we did. No offense to our kicker. There's Kalalilamoku. No, he's still an impact guy. So we. I guess we just had two for a little while, but Gronk is back at impact, which is good. All right, let's check out Louisiana Tech. Starting quarterback, Zach Champion. He can't run, so we can attack him some today. This guy is going to do everything for him, but hopefully they will throw the ball most of the time. He's their leading rusher, leading receiver, and he's on special teams. He does everything. Decent backup behind him. Nothing at fullback. Receiving core, about average for the conference, I say, but they got a lot of receivers, so, you know, they're going to spread us out some today. Tight ends, they got 78 overall for both. The backup's a little, a little faster and can catch the ball. That guy's a good little... Ball player right there, Willie Mullins. He looks the part for a good receiving tight end. They have him as a blocking tight end, though, which I find interesting. Offensive line, 82, 78, 70, 70, and 80. So nothing great on the interior. Maybe we can uh, get a bit of a rush up the middle some. They run a 3-4. They got a true freshman defensive in here, 6-4 260. 65 overall, 72 overall. So they got two true freshmen on the ends, and this guy's really small. See, I don't think the game recognizes that if your team runs a 3-4 defense, hey, you may need to recruit bigger defensive ends. I just don't think the game gets that, which is kind of understandable, but I guess that's something they could have put in. This guy's big enough to play defense tackle. At least he's 300 pounds. He's tall, 87 overall. Not an impact guy, though. And they don't have much behind him, but again, it's a 3-4 defense. They don't need many defensive tackles. 68, 80, and 76, and 78. So nothing spectacular at linebacker. This is the guy who does a little bit of everything for him. Tackles, interceptions, and such. Nothing at corner. We should be able to exploit some of this today. Of course, we throw short a lot anyways because of our offensive line. we got to get the ball out kind of quick. So these two guys right here are going to have a lot of work to do. Pretty good free safety. He's an impact guy, but he's really slow. And this guy's even slower at strong safety. So I think we can do some serious damage on this defense as long as we play smart. Their backup kicker is an impact guy, just like ours. So we got an impact kicker, which is still kind of goofy. but And they got an average punter. Okay. I think we are ready to get this show on the road. I'm going to kick like normal until we give up a touchdown. Then I'll have to kick high. We'll kick away from that impact guy, if possible. It looks like that's not going to work. That's going to go right towards him. I kicked it badly. There we go. We're going to play a lot of zone. We're going to make them just throw short, keep everything in front of us. Maybe we can pick a, a pass off here and there. Make a play. First play of the game. We'll take it. Just a bad throw. I don't know who he was throwing to. Either it was a bad throw or we just had two guys sitting there. Did somebody get stuck? He threw it too early. You see what happened there? 
He threw the ball way too early. It was supposed to go to this guy on the corner, but he threw it before he made his cut. That's why he threw it the way he did. Okay, we'll take that. Now, let's... We kind of make, what, one adjustment? Is it here? The twin halfback? Yes. That's our one adjustment I think we have to make. Let's go curl read. We're on the right hash. They're going zone to dime. What I can do... I'm just going to throw it. We'll just go to Ferguson. That may be a face mask. Probably a five-yarder. Yeah, five yards. First and ten. We are still on the right hash. Let's go slot corners. They're going man. I'm going to see if I can go to Bess here in case they, that other safety comes down. Nope. I snap. Good catch by Davis. They did go one high there. I forgot to make that one adjustment. There was a. I think I'm going to replace uh, a formation with something else so I can add a few more left, ha left hash plays. I just forgot to do that. I mean, we've done just fine without it. But we'll stick with this for now. Uh, I'm going to have... We're going to do that. We're going to slant G. Mullen. Maybe he can do a pick. And I'll have... I was going to have Rackley go over the top just in case they went cover zero, but they didn't. You go he here, you notice who defended the halfback. It was that safety coming. So that's just... That guy has no chance. And he bumped into him right there. So all this space, just an easy pitch and catch for a first down. We're on the 17. Uh, let's go... Uh, let's do triangle. That's fine. Man dime. I'm going to leave it as is. I just dropped it. The reason why I went to him was because it was a man-beating play. They, they went man, so I wanted to go to an easy man-beater, but that didn't work. He dropped it. That's okay. We'll go to tight end streaks. We're going man here. We'll go back to him, see if he can catch this. I got hit as soon as I threw it. That's good defense. So we are, it's third and ten. I guess we'll go deep attack. We're going man. I may end up... Let's see what happens with these safeties. Yeah, I got no choice. Ah, I overthrew it. I was wanting to go to my post, but they went with a cover one right here. And that would have been picked off. So that was like my only option was to go over here. We'll kick the field goal. Hopefully I can make this. So Gronk was slightly off on a few of those throws, but let's see if I can get this to go down. Should go through. Perfect kick. Good deal. At least we got some points. I wanted a touchdown, but three is better than none. We'll get back on defense. See if I can kick it to this guy. Ah, dang it. I'm going to go back and kick it to the other guy. I hit the button too early. The third one. Very fortunate that we're getting good stops there. They may go four wide on us a ton. I may sprinkle in a little bit of three, four, just to break it up a little bit from the nickel. But if they keep going four wide, it will just go back and forth between the two. Ooh, good defense. I was able to get a hand on it. Like they're going five wide here. I have no choice but to go nickel. I could go dime. I'm, the dime's okay, but I do just fine with nickel. If you look at our corners, it's a real drop off once you get down. To, I mean, it's okay. I'm just curious why is this guy over this guy? Moss over. Hmm. Oh, that's why. Because I, sometimes I blitz with the nickel. Never mind. That's why I have him sitting there. If we'll go back to the same play. Yes. Cut. 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 Drops back to pass. He steps 
Ah, he threw it too early again. Threw it before his break. So now they're going three wide. We'll stay here, though. We're going to go cloud since it's third and ten. Let's see if I can get to this guy. Look at their... They got decent offensive linemen. Or uh, tackles, at least. Ah, good play by the quarterback. Ah, good catch. He got out of the way just in time to make the throw. Uh, we can go... I want to go 3-4. Where's it at? We'll do this crash, too. Let's do this instead. I'll be the back end blitzer. We got two blitzers on this side. Well, at least he ran to our blitz side, but he picked up four yards. I'm going to do another zone blitz. They're not going to show a whole lot of one tight end looks, I don't think, today. So I'm going to take advantage of that and do some blitzing. Hopefully he passes here. Nope, we're going right up the gut. Thank the Lord there was no hole there. That was the perfect play call against that defense. We'll go back to Cloud. Maybe we can get a stop this time. Again, we're going up against two decent tackles. Went play action. Fine by me. Thankfully, the defensive end got around his tackle. Let's see if we can get a decent... A little instant replay there. They're going to punt it. Let's see if we can get the ball back. No surprise here. They prepare to punt it away. I'd like to get a touchdown this time instead of a field goal. Somebody get a block on the right. Get a block right there. We are on the right hash. What haven't we called yet? Let's go through our... We'll go RB deep. We're going man. Just for going man, I am going to have Rackley go over the top, just in case. Going cover one. Uh-oh. That may be a touchdown. The guy failed. He tried to go for the swat, and it didn't work. That was a good throw, too. It helps. Don't want to get a penalty there. Yeah, it helps if he dives. It happens every now and then when you throw it to an out route. Okay, good deal. We got the touchdown that we wanted. Let's get an extra point, go up 10. You could already tell we got the better team, so this doesn't shock me. And you saw their depth chart, their defense especially, just don't, don't have hardly any talent there. Okay, I'm going to try to kick it to this guy on the left. I'm 0 for 2 on that so far. Okay, this should work. There we go. Now watch him return it with ease. <laughs> I'll cut the outside. Ah, dude. Dang it! Oh, you gotta be kidding. I told you something goofy was gonna happen. Ah. We will stay here. We'll run like a 4-3 makeshift thing. And they're going to run it. Ah, dang it. One juke, and he was gone. They need to keep giving him the ball. I'm going to do his own blitz, though. I think they're going to throw here. If not, though, they're going to force us to play some man. Some cover one to try to stop the run. Ah, good play. Great ball. Great, great play by the quarterback. Went right by me. Okay, I wasn't expecting any of that, so I guess they're going to force me to go one high. They're going to go off tackle. Good stop by somebody. That might have been Kolo Lomoku. They're going to go four wide here. Let's do an all-out blitz. They are going to go here. They're going to go halfback off tackle. They always call it. Told you. Told you. Told you. Dang it. He's still going to score. I swear. Ah, he didn't score. <laughs> okay. Uh, we'll go man lock. 
now they're going goal line, so it's untelling what they'll call here. They put everyone up on the line. Maybe they'll pass. Back to pass. He tosses it short. He threw it. We that was odd. I guess he was feeling the pressure. Wow, what a stop. On the goal line. Hopefully they don't fake it here. That's why I went safe, man. Big stop right there. Bet they get their field goal. Now we're down. We're up a touchdown. That was a good drive by them, though. They just couldn't punch it in. Quarterback played much better on that drive. I wasn't expecting the run game either. I thought they was going to just throw the whole time. All right, let's see if Ferguson can work his magic. No blocking whatsoever. Yes, not. All right, we are back on the right hash. Let's go. Let's go double wide receiver screen. We're going zone. I'd love to audible to a run, but we don't have any running backs out there. So we'll go here, pick up five yards. Not bad. We can go back to curl read. We're going man. We'll do this. We'll go to one of the outside guys. Didn't get the first. It's third and two. And we're in the middle of the field. I'm going to go ahead and attempt deep cross up. And they're going man. We'll just go. We'll go to Davis and pick up the easy first down. I just done an, a hot route. With uh, went to an out on that one. We are on the left hash. I'm gonna go back. Uh, nah, I'm not gonna do it. Let's do zigouts instead. We're going man three four. We'll go to somebody on the right. Threw it slightly behind him, but we got some yards. This may be the last play of the quarter. Zone dime. We're just going to wait. I'm going to let that clock go. All right. We are up a touchdown. We're going to head into the second quarter. We'll go back to triangle. We're going nickel here, so I'll probably leave it as is. I'm going to get a little better cushion for G. Mullen, just in case. Get the first down there. Uh, probably a holding. Rough in the passer. We'll take it. We can look here and see what happened. Yeah, that was way late. Okay. He can get upset all he wants, but it is what it is on that one. Right hash here. I'm trying to think. Uh, we can go back to slot corners. We're going zone on this one. We'll go to either G. Mullen or Rackley. Not the best throw. Got three out of it. We'll go halfback out. Haven't called this today. They're going zone nickel. I can try to go over the middle. Wow. Somebody came through really quick. Oh, wow, yeah. My right guard just whiffed on him all together. Can't even put my cursor on the guy. Just completely missed him. He knew it, too. We're very fortunate we got the ball out like we did. We got some yards out of that? I don't know how. So it's third and five. I am going to go tight in streaks. And we're going man. What we're going to do is go to our best player. We'll go to Ferguson. Get exactly what we need. He had the dig. Or the out route that was just enough to get the first down. I don't think the hot route, or I should say the out route that is a hot route, is like only five yards, and we needed, what, seven? We may have needed five, but this one was much a deeper out route. 
which is what I needed. Perfect throw, perfect play call, all that good stuff. Good adjustment. Oh, it's fourth and inches. How in the world? Okay. Uh... We'll go zig out. Number nine, back in the gun, back to pass, looking with the throw. Just an easy play, pitch there, just to get the yards. I can't believe they just got it on fourth down. This defense was ready to leave the. We can. Uh, I'm trying to think of what have we had when we called. We went through a lot of our base stuff, so we can just go through them again. We'll go back to RB deep. Going man again. I'll hot route Rackley just in case. I'd rather have him going a deep than anything else. Six points again. He went for the SWAT. I told you their corners are weak, so that's why you need to attack. And it shows. Both of their outside corners are just struggling today. So it looks like Davis is having a good game so far. We're seeing a lot of high snaps, as expected. Our center isn't the best in the world. But half of our offense is from the gun. And thankfully, our new play calling, our new play, so we're, we are calling, has a lot of the quick out stuff. So the high snap shouldn't affect us too much today as long as we keep going to those pivot routes. All right, stretch the lead a bit. We need to do a little bit better job on defense this go around. See if we can get a better stop here. I'm going to get the outside edge if I can. But the kicker, it's kind of hard. Look at this. Uh -huh. Scary. All right. Right hash. They are doing that. I'm going to do another zone blitz. I'm just assuming they're going to throw more than run, so we're going to take that chance. Let's see if Allen Jones can get around here. Maybe they'll go play action. Going draw. Good stop, though. Who made the play? It was our impact running back. No, this guy right here, defensive end. Stopped him just enough to push him into the defensive tackle. Good play by the defensive tackle. Let's go quarters and a nickel. Hawaii has one of the toughest defenses we've seen. I agree 100%. We're going to stay here. They've done so far. Some very impressive just in case they run it. Very, very play. Nope, they're going to run the ball. Ah, dang it. Good run right there. So it's what, third and one? They're doing that. If they're going to do that, let's do a 4-4. Four, four, which is a good complement to the either the 4-3 or the 3-4. Good defense by everybody. I, as you can tell, I'm sitting right here. And at this point, I can tell I'm not going to get to the quarterback. So I'm going to back out in coverage. I'm going to find the closest guy that I can defend. And I decided to go after this tight end right here. And I didn't make an impact. The other guy technically did, but still, good defense all around. They are close to midfield. We'll do the all-out block. That way nothing goofy happens on the back end. The Bulldogs line up the punt. Butler punts it, and it's a good one. Uh, I'm going to fair catch that one. We're in the middle of the field. We will go deep cross up, see if we can do something there. They're going man. And they're doing that. Going one high. Just give the Ferguson pick up a few yards, not a whole lot. We can go back. The triangle. They're going man dime. They're at least going one high. They're at least doing that. What I'm going to do is do that just in case, because I'd rather go to Rackley. Let's see if he can make a play and get under it. Ah, good defense. He just couldn't get over the corner. So it's third and seven. We'll go deep attack. We're going zone. Hopefully we can make this play. Dang it. And a fumble. Ah, oh, terrible play. Just terrible play all around. Huge hole over the middle. I'm like, this is going to be an easy pitch and catch for Ferguson, but he short arms it. He has to come back for it. I was hoping he was going to catch it like right here where I can just scoot up for a first down. And then 
I tried to do a spin move, and that probably what caused the fumble. That's a big play right there. They score right here, then they'll get back within a touchdown. Wow, that is a big play. It's not where you want to fumble. Ah, completely missed him. Thankfully, somebody got to him. To win with the off tackle. Or that could have been a PA read. I'm going to go back to the same play. I think they're going to throw it here. Keep showing that hanging tight end, and i got to take my chance on a blitz. And you can blitz against 10 personnel, too. I just love to do it against 11 personnel. I feel like I got a little bit better success with it. By all means, blitz against whatever you need to blitz against. Okay, third and eight. It'd be amazing if we could hold him to a field goal. Let's see if I can control this guy. I'm having bad luck on the other end. There we go. Didn't get the sack, but we got to stop, and we're going to kick another field goal. So our defense is playing great. If you can keep the other team out of the end zone, you can't go wrong. Just that's the name of the game. You're going to give up your yards by all means. I'm not a real picky about giving up yards. If that's going to happen, then so be it. I just want you out of the end zone. I want to, I don't want you scoring points. Get down to the red zone as often as you want, as long as you don't get in the end zone. So we got an 11-point lead. We got two minutes to go. Plenty of time to try to get down the field and score another touchdown. Let's see if Davis can do something here. He's having a great game so far. A couple touchdowns. Good tackle there. Left hash. We can go back to our base left hash play. Man dime. I could easily run it here, but this should be a decent man beaten play. We're going to do that. That's good coverage. You get the first down, though, with Larson. First and 10. Let's go tight end streaks. We're going zone. 3-4. This will be going to Davis. Get about six yards there. Second and four. We can go back to this play. RB deep. We're going man. This is the one formation I'll probably get rid of. And we're putting gun normal. I just forget to do it. Let's see if Rackley can do a better job here. Get on top of it. Perfect throw. Amazing throw. Let's see if they show a good replay here. A little wobbly on the spiral. But that was right in stride. You normally have to see the half the receiver have to go up and try to jump or reach for it. This guy right here ended up perfect right in stride. Right where it needed to be. That was a good adjustment by the receiver too. It helps. This is going to be a good thumbnail right here. Either one of them will work. Good deal. So we got plenty of time, and it's a minute 34. Let's go. Curl Reed. Man dime here. I'm going to run the ball. We haven't got to run the ball maybe like once today. We'll go to the left. Just don't fumble it. Good play there. On the five. We can go. I'm going to run clock. I didn't think about running clock on the last play. They are going man here. Hopefully nothing goofy happens. Now, this could be a really good man-beating play, but I've seen it do really weird things as well. But we're going to go to Davis over here. That's just, they're giving us, you know, a man look, so we're going to go to our man-beater on this one. Get it down to a couple of seconds. And good defense. You're hoping for a good block right there, but it didn't happen. Now, we may get a face mask. We'll take that. Fine by me. And we may get a running clock to go with that. Let's go slam. Let's just run the ball in. Zone 3-4. We'll try to go in between the tackles more than likely. And that shift makes it all the reason to go to the right. Let that clock go down to a couple seconds. And then we will hopefully score a touchdown and have a nice lead going into halftime. 
Yeah, perfect blocking everywhere. Good deal. All right. I'm really liking, I'll go ahead and say this, I'm really liking our two halfback system. It'd be great if you had one halfback that could do it all, but Scruggs is more of a downhill runner, and that's what we have him for. Then Larson is a little bit better on the back end in terms of catching passes and such. So that's worked out pretty well. Now, when Washington gets back, you better believe it, he's going to go back to where he was because we got to use that 94 speed. But either way, it's a cool little two halfback system. It's a good adjustment when uh, Washington got hurt. I'm glad I didn't forget that Larson can do some things in the backfield like that in the passing game. That way it takes the pressure off for both of those guys too. So it works out pretty well. So if you wanted to run an offense like this and you weren't for sure what type of halfback you wanted, you wanted a more downhill runner or do you want somebody who could just catch passes, just go ahead and get both. It's okay if you can't find a halfback that can do both. Just get one of each or two of each. That way they can, you know, don't have too much pressure to carry the entire load per se. So there's 25 seconds. They're going to probably do something with this. So we'll get, once they get close to midfield, we'll start going deep on some things. Get a tackle there. Good play right there. They're going to call a timeout too. Second and 10 with 18 seconds. I'm thinking they're still going to do something normal before they try to do a Hail Mary. I've ah, done that correct incorrectly. Good stop there though. So it's third and 10, 15 seconds. That was the tight end's for fault. Ah, right, we'll go. They're going five wide. So. We'll go Clad. I don't think they're doing Hail Mary here. I could be wrong. Nope, they're not going to. Oh, wow, good catch. And they called a timeout, so now we got to go too high, man. Got no choice here. We are probably going to do a Hail Mary on this play, if I had to guess. That's good defense. Yeah, a couple guys came through. They got one more try, though, so they're going to do the same thing. This is another Hail Mary. This is the two-back version. If I can get to... I just can't get through... Oh my gosh. Our guy went for a swat. You notice here. It was a good try by the by the receiver or the uh, quarterback. He tried to go for a swat, but he just didn't time it right. Thank the Lord we went too high man. Otherwise, that would have been six points. Good job by Oliver making the stop. So we have a 18-point lead. We can check out some stats and scores. Our offense is playing great course. Running the ball, we're not doing much of anything. We don't have to because our passing game is lights out right now. These last three games, our passing game has been exactly where it needs to be, and it started ever since I made that change. I'm not toting, tooting my own horn here, but I like to think that made a big difference. Uh, we're just playing cleaner football that way, making it easier on my, hat, on my offensive line and such. Our third down conversion is terrible. We got to do a whole lot better job of that. But both teams are playing it pretty clean. One turnover each. What was our turnover? I didn't throw an interception. Oh, we had the fumble. That's right. That was my fault on that fumble. And I think they had the one interception as that first play of the game. But you look at Gronk, 20 of 24, 230, two touchdowns, no picks. Just playing great right now. I'm, I'm making it easy for him as best I can. And we get the ball started the third quarter. Love to get a touchdown here and really stretch this lead. see if Ferguson can do something. I'll go ahead and attempt this. Ah, ooh. I almost done the spin move. That would have been a nightmare. I shouldn't have done that. Very fortunate we didn't fumble it there. They're going man dime on this one. I'm going to go ahead and leave it as is. Because we got too many good man beaters to not try. Not the best throw. Interference. Well, all the penalties are going in our direction. 
are going our way today. We get the first down. It looks like it, we got an ex, ex, we gained an extra yard there, I should say. Let's go. I had it on my mind. Uh, it wasn't this play. It wasn't where was it at? Uh, let's do zig outs. Man, nickel. That guy's on him. Okay, another high snap. Get some yards there. We can stay here and go back to slot corners. Zone dime. They got terrible corners, so stretch them out, make them go like four, or going dime and such makes helps a lot. Get the first down with Rackley. Seven straight completions. Of course, I'm giving them very easy throws. As best as I can, at least. We'll go half back out here. They're going man. One thing I wanted to try. He's doing that. Uh, we're going to leave it as is. One high. I threw that way too early. That's my fault. My fault. My fault. Had him beat big time, too. We'll go back and call something similar. We'll go curl read. Zone nickel. We'll leave it as is. Now, one thing I will adjust. I'm going to have Rankley go deep. Give me a go post. But they're going with a funky defense there. Oh, just terrible throw by Gronk. I don't know who that was going to. All right, third and ten. We'll go deep attack. Haven't done a good job on the third downs today. I'm going to try to hit. I'm going to get hit myself. He couldn't get open. I don't think somebody got caught or something. Of course, my right side of my line just got demolished. I probably should have threw it right there. I keep it, That's all my fault, I think. It just wasn't very good play. On the 41, high, let's, we'll punt it. I'm going to high kick this thing. Though. I don't want him to get an easy touchdown. I completely botched this. Oh, that's awful. I hit the button extremely late. That's all my fault. Oh, that's just a bad turn of events right there. Let's we'll see if our defense can bail me out here. We're running a 4-3. Good defense, Al. Went with a draw, I believe. We're going five wide, so we'll stick with nickel. Since we're going five wide, I can do this. Show like a five-man front. When in actuality, I am going out in coverage there. Ah, good, good, good throw. So it's third and one. I don't think he got the first. We're doing that. Uh, I'm going to take a... This could be this could be really dumb. I'm gonna go fire too. It's on my mind. They may do a simple run here. I'm gonna do this though, because they may do the halfback off tackle. Yep, that's what they went with, and we got the stop. Good deal. Now they may go for it here. Oh, my defense is bailing me out today. Having a great game. Hopefully this will go in the end zone, give us some cushion on the opening drive. Fair catch, I'm going out, getting out of the way on this one. Ah, oh, good, good play by the by the Bulldogs. So on the four, I'm gonna run the ball. Ooh, thank. Now they're blitzing both of their inside guys. I'm still gonna run it. Just get a couple yards, not a whole lot. We're going to go with curls. They're going dime every time I call this, which is pretty smart of him, I guess. That's good coverage by the defense. They had the strong safety on him. I had to throw it quick. But we got out of our end zone. So we're on the right hash. I want to call play. We're going to go with corner combo. We're going zone dime. What I'm going to do, since it's 
that, I am going to just run it. That was a weird run play for me. I was wanting to go to the right, but I saw that guy blitzing, that linebacker, so I just turned to the left. Plus, there's not a whole lot of room to run right there. So I went to the left, and thankfully, there's a hole right there. So do not use the speed button at any point during that time. Just try to get around, find a hole, and make a play. And that'll be a gain of 10 by the running Ended up being a really good play overall. So it's second and inches. We're in the middle of the field. They're going zone on my deep cross up. Maybe we can attack this strong safety. Not feeling a whole lot of heat. Ooh, not the best throw. Thankfully, we made the play, though. Not a good throw at all. He had to come back a little bit for it. Back on the right hash we go. Let's go do zig outs from five wide. They're going zone nickel. I'm going to do this instead. I'm going to have him on a slant. Not make him work. Ooh, good defense. Guy was just sitting there waiting on it. Second and 10. We'll go back to Curl Reed. They're going man. I'm going to adjust so Rackley can go over the top just because he's bigger than everybody else. Get the first down with Davis. If I'll, I'll go ahead and show you this. So he makes the catch. As soon as he makes the catch, do not use, I didn't use the speed button here. If I had used the speed button, it would have took me a little bit longer to get upfield. Without using the speed button, I could get upfield a little quicker, thus getting the first down. That's the reason why I've done that. Now, we're in the middle of the field here. I'm going to go back to five wide. If I can get to it. No, let's go to this version. We'll do a screen from here. They're going man on this one, so what I may do, the Warriors, come on. I may have him go over here. Throw on first down. He's got we'll go to Ferguson. Do, well, that's just a simple adjustment. The slot, the screen doesn't work off as well against man as it does against zone, so I think I was going to get stopped there. So I just hot ratted Ferguson, moved him over to the left, made him an out route just to pick up the yards. Right hash. Now, one thing, or left hash, one thing I can try, it hasn't worked for us well this year. We can do halfback streak. It's a rollout play, but defenses have usually done a pretty good job against it. Let's see if we can do something here. Eh, we may have a chance. Good throw. He had to come back for it a little bit, but it was good enough. That's a fumble, but that's okay. First of 10 on the 14. Let's go back to triangle. Zone nickel. We'll leave it as is. They're making us work for it on this drive. That's for sure. I'll make that adjustment. Get that pivot route a little bit more space. Ooh, great defense. I think they went cover three. No, they went cover two. They went max cover two. What they done. That and it helps that they don't have a whole lot of room to cover. So they can come down a little bit quicker. I probably should have threw it right there instead of back here. Very fortunate that wasn't picked off. At second ten, we'll go RB deep. Going zone. We'll go to Ferguson. Not a whole lot of yardage there. We will go uh, third and eight. We're gonna go tight end streaks. They're going zone. I actually think we could pick up the eight yards. When you get this tight of window, we can get pretty tough. I'm kind of glad they're going zone, though. Ooh, that probably would have been a first down, but good defense. So they're going to force us to kick a field goal. That was right at the first down marker. So kudos to Louisiana Tech. They're playing better defense than I expected. That should be an easy, okay, good deal. Easy field goal. Get one of those field goals back. That was a long drive. It took us forever to get down the field. Of course, we started on our own four. And they kept everything in front of them, too. So that's a good way to play defense against this particular scheme. Make me work for it. Hopefully, something, a turnover will happen. 
They're going two wide here, but I'm going to go quarters at a 3 4. Please don't run up the gut. Halfback raid, you can run that play every day. That's fine by me. Second and 10. We'll go quarters. Second and 10. Ball on their own 23. The defensive back's moving in closer. We'll stay in. Counter. Good open field tackle there, so it's what, third and five? That is the end of the quarter. We're up three touchdowns. Thankfully, our defense is playing lights out right now. I mean, you couldn't ask for anything better. Offense is playing well, too, but give it up for Louisiana Tech's defense. They're keeping me out of the end zone a couple of times. Ooh, let's go third and four. It's untailing what they're going to do here. They could keep it simple, just give it to their running back, but I think they're going to throw it. So that's what we'll go for. Play action. Good defense, Al. I went back in the coverage. You see me over there on the right. I could tell I was not going to get a sack here. So I just backed out in coverage and went to that tight end. Thankfully, otherwise that was going to be a first down. Well, the defense could tell there. Well, the defense did what they had to do to get three. We'll go double cross. Let's see if we can return this. We're going to have to fair catch this one. I don't think we're going to get a block on that dude. Back on the right hash we go. We can try. Um... Uh, I had one play on my mind. Let's go with it. Let's do the tight end corner. They're going zone. They're going dime. Jeez. But I don't have an audible for this formation. Nope. Since they're going zone, we'll go. Ah, he overthrew it. Perfect zone beater, but it's not a very good throw. We can try something else. We can go... Halfback out. They're going man here, which is good. As long as we can make the throw. They're going one high. They never go cover zero when I call this play. I don't know why. They just don't. Ah, oh, perfect catch. Terrible throw. Great catch. Third and inches, though. So we'll go curls. They're going zone dime. I think I may run this. Let's see if we can pick up the... First down here. Good little adjustment there. Let's do a screen. Zone dime. We'll just go to our zone beater on the right. Just go up, get vertical on that one, might as well. So that is what, second and seven? We can stay here and... There's some other good plays in this formation, but I'm trying to think of just ways to get the ball out pretty quickly. Like, I'd love to do some mesh type stuff, but it takes a little longer to develop. Looks like they're going zone here. We can have a center beater just in case. Gets about six yards there, maybe five. Third and three. Let's do tight end streaks for the th three yards. We don't need a ton of yards, so we can just go like this with Davis to an out route. I dropped it, but wow, just a lot of penalties today. We'll take it. Rubbed into the guy, I guess. First and ten. So what? Are we still on the right hash? Yes, we are. Okay. We'll go back to Curl Reed. We're going man nickel. We'll leave it as is. Uh, we can try G Mullen over the top. See that. They're still going one high. We'll go to Davis. Davis is having a big game today. Just the ball's going to him a lot. That's just what they're giving us. We'll go deep cross up again. They're going man. I may do the same thing. We'll go back to Davis. Good throw there. Just pick up a first down. 
We are on the left hash. I want to try. Is it this one? Yes. We're going to go slants. They're going man. This is what I wanted to say. Going 5 2 of all things. But this is going to go to Larson. We're going to go over here. Perfect pick play. Good deal. Just don't fumble it. Probably wasn't a good idea to juke right there. What happened was I moved Scruggs over, so either this guy or this guy could do B on Larson. And as you can tell, when I come over here, he his own defender picks on him. So you can't ask for a better scenario. So I just bounce it over here to Larson. He's got a big cushion between him and his defender. First of 10 on the right hash. I don't think what we haven't called. Let's go. Let's, da, 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 da. I know I, I can do some hot route stuff. Let's do corner strike. Have a look at our old they're going zone and they're going dime. I may just audible to a run here. And we'll go to the left. Looks like we got got a little bit of room little more weakness on their de defensive side on the left. Pick up six yards right there, and he is gassed. Let's do another dive. Let's just go straight to a run. They're going man nickel. Let's see who's on who. I guess we'll go to the left. Ooh, just enough. See if we can get a touchdown for Scruggs. Pick up six points. Good deal. All right. I think we got this game well in hand. Thankfully, McCray didn't have a holding there. 33 to 6. Going to get an extra point, hopefully. Still got a, about two minutes to go. I think what I may do. Mass subs? I can't do the mass subs because I don't have the safeties for it, do I? Yeah, I got Okay, yeah, we're good at strong safety. So what I can do is go to mass subs. I'm going to at least do second team defense. I can't do it for the offense because we're kind of weak in, in a couple areas. I think it's my right guard situation isn't very good. So we're going to have Brennan play, and we're going to leave the rest as is. That's fine. So Colt Brennan's going to go in for a few snaps, maybe. We'll just see how our second team defense does against their offense. I'm assuming they're going to keep their first string out there. We'll do this. I had not a strong kick. Hard of time. Just takes practice. Good stop. For our base, we can do 4-3 or 3-4. I'm going to do 3-4. I don't think we can do nickel. You see here, we're okay at linebacker, we're okay there, and we're okay there. Halfback draw from the gun. It's a good tackle. Thankfully, their impact running back isn't just like running around on us all day. We'll stick with the same play. We'll just stick with quarters. Louisiana Tech goes with the set here. Drops back to pass. Ah, that was my fault. I stopped. And they push him out. I stopped. I should have kept going with him. So their passing game didn't do a whole lot today. Our defense is just much better than their scheme, that's for sure. Number 10 has four receivers lined up here. Going counter. Good open field tackle. I'll tell you, our backups are making tackles at least. Uh, we'll stick with three. I'll just stick with the same play. It doesn't matter. It's second down and eight to go. Ball on the 44. Louisiana Tech comes out with two. We'll leave it as is. Let's start to go on Ace Twins. Back to pass. Steps up, looking. He'll dump this one off. I just couldn't get to him over there. Thankfully, he tried to do a spin move right into me. We got a player hurt, injured his head. It's probably not too serious. Third and three. Since we're doing that, I may try to do like a fancy zone blitz. Let's do a basic cover three with a zone blitz on the right. We can try that. I can control the blitzer. Halfback off tackle. Gun normal. I should have known. They've been calling that play a lot today. 
Went right by me. I'm going to do a zone blitz from 4-3. Give our 3-4 a bit of a break. Joel White is out for the season. Normally, you don't see... Normally, you do not see a head injury be too severe. It's usually something just kind of minor. Not this one. Severe concussion out for the season. So, he is a defensive end. That means... He is our third stringer. He's our third stringer across the board. I hate that form, though. He's, you know, I mean, we recruited him for the 3-4 because he's got the size for it. I hate that form. Doesn't even get to play often and still gets hurt. Good throw. Ah, good. Just couldn't bring it down. Second and 10. And we'll just do quarters out of three, four. So it's second and ten. Ball on the forty-six yard line. Going with the shotgun here. Another halfback draw. There he goes. Ah, shoestring tackle. So it's third and one. Takes a timeout. Calling a timeout. They're doing that. I... Let's do a crash too. Just throw something weird at him. The game's about over, so it's not that big of a deal what we call at this point. Ah, uh, made the right adjustment, but still got the first down. Fourth, oh, it's fourth and inches. I still got to go 3-4. We don't have the bodies to do nickel on the back end. Let's do a one-high all-out blitz on him. Oh, they went play action. Wide open. Whoo! What play was that? So they're going ace trips. It's the play action. Oh, it's the switch concept. Against man. Now, who was against him? Did he get caught on somebody? We can check here really quick. No, he just got beat badly. Look at that. Wide open. Just a bad throw. No choice there but to go for it. And we're going to get the ball back. 48 seconds to go. This defense isn't going to let up or relax at all. So what I can do, we can let Colt throw a few. We're going zone dime. I'll probably audible. Oops, so audible to the, or went to the wrong side, but that's okay. We got the yards we wanted. Second and three. Oh, let's do a slot screen. We're going man. We'll just go over here to Davis. Intercepted. That's my fault. That was all my fault. That went on Brandon. When you got, when you're trying to do an out route on a screen like that, you got to get it off quick. And they came in really hot. And that by this point, just a good defense. He tapped it to his teammate. Just a good play. Again, that went on Brandon. That was on me. All right, back to defense we go. I could have ended this thing, but I chose to get fancy with it and start a throwing. I want to give Colt some throws. Stinks his first one was an interception, but again, that was my fault. Big play, Al. Good for you. I was able to get in front of that thing. I got right in front of both me and Jasmine was going to make a play there. We'll go RB deep. We're going man. I still got all my starters out there. Except for, you know, Brandon. He's back up. I just dropped it. Straight up dropped it. Let's do a halfback out. Zone dime here. If we don't get at least some yards here with Larson, then I may just have to take a knee. All right, good deal. At least he got one reception or at least one uh, catch. One completion, I should say. We're going to let him do one more if I can get to the line quick enough. And he drops it. Come on. Help out, Brandon. Look at that. Just Davis, all of a sudden, he's had the best game of his life, and he dropped two straight passes. Too hot for him. All right, 
Game over, 34 to 6. We can check out some stats. 422 yards. Our passing game is where it was at, obviously. 364 yards. No sacks. Our third down conversion was awful today, though. Thankfully, Louisiana Tech, their offense just couldn't do much of anything, especially their passing game. They just struggled. Um, we put some pressure on them, and we kept everything in front of us so that they couldn't throw deep. Uh, but their quarterback isn't the best in the world. It helps you if you've got a really good quarterback to make it work, and they don't really have one. Ended up having a couple turnovers apiece. Let's see. Uh, we'll go individual stats. I wanted to check out, again, Gronk. Good-looking stat line right there. Unfortunately, Brennan, he could have done better, but that was more... I mean, there was, what, two drops? It None of it was really on him. He looked pretty good when he was able to throw. Running the ball, we don't do enough of it, so it didn't make that big of a difference. But you look at the averages. When we run, we're, ve we're very efficient. Seven and a half yards, six, you know, over six yards. Then we're saving. Davis had 11 receptions. He could have had 13, but he had two touchdowns. Ferguson had a bunch. A lot of guys got to catch the ball today, as usual. Defensively, I wanted to see who stood out here. Ingram ended up having the best game, it seems. Tackles, tackles for loss. He had a sack. We had a couple guys get interceptions. Good to see all of that. And as you can check by the box score, it wasn't much of a game, really. They got within a touchdown a couple times in the first half, but we was able to stretch it the farther we went into the game. All right, let's get out of here. I don't know who we played next. I'm pretty sure it's another conference game. We're getting close to where a couple of recruits are ready to take visits. They're going to advance the week. We're going to go ahead and let it do so. We'll let it speed up here. And we'll see who our next opponent is. I do not want to save right yet. We got New Mexico State. So this is another team that throws the ball over the lot. But look at their defense. Their defense is playing Oh, that's ours. <laughs> I'm an idiot. <laughs> I was like, well, look at that defense. They're pretty strong. No, hey, I'll look over to the left side of the screen. So New Mexico State, they're two and three. They got a they lost their last game. Their passing offense is exceptional. Again, another top five passing attack, but we'll see if they can do something against us. It depends if they got a decent quarterback or not. And their defense is absolutely terrible. Hopefully we can exploit that. So come on back. We'll take on New Mexico State. And I'll talk to you later.